So ladies and gentlemen, a warm welcome to you all. All around the Frankfurt Motor Show there are so many wonderful cars to see that it's really nice if uh, once in a while you can actually sit at the steering wheel of one of them, isn't it? In my view, there's nothing uh, better for that than a generous portion of AMG driving performance. You've experienced it live again today. We are at home on the racetrack. This is particularly true for our GTR, but also for the whole GT family. But of course, not only for it. At the Frankfurt Motor Show, we showed with our Project One how the future of, AMG, uh, of driving performance is defined by AMG. Our hypercar is the ultimate proof we want optimum performance <coughs> and maximum driving enjoyment. That is and remains what we stand for. But here and now, we are just talking about today's driving pleasure. Our GT family shows perfectly how that works today. That begins with the wide variety. After all, each of us has a different idea of what he or she would uh, want from a real driving machine. And we have the right car for every customer's wish. You know, after the SLS AMG, the AMG GT is the second car that we have developed solely at Affalterbach, which makes it the essence of what AMG stands for. And since the start of the GT in 2014, we have, uh, there have been quite a few additions to that family. So by now we have got a family of eight members. We have four coupes, starting with the GT and the GTS. The GTS is now available with 522 horsepower instead of 510 and also optionally available with rear axis steering. Brand new, on the occasion of our company's anniversary, we have the GTC Edition 50 Coupe. And finally, we have got our top coupe, the GTR. In addition, we have two Roadster models, which is the GT and the GTC. And also two pedigree customer sport racing cars, the GT3 and recently the GT4. That also means that we offer the GT in a power output grade and four power output grades from 476 horsepower up to 585. This includes various versions of engine mapping, <coughs> transmission settings, suspensions, tires and also aerodynamics. And of course, every range has the equipment details to match. The technical strengths of character is something that all uh, the members of the GT family have in common. That includes the front mid-engine concept with the transaxle dual clutch transmission at the rear axle. We have got a racing suspension with aluminium double wishbones. We have got the active optimization of the aerodynamics. And of course, intelligent lightweight as the basis for a highly dynamic driving experience. As for example, our 231 kilogram light aluminium space frame body. As you see, we mean it seriously when we say these cars were born on the racetrack. Our two models for international customer motorsport prove which excellent basis the street GT provides. It is of course still subject to specific changes for use in the international racing series. For example, we have a complete bodywork made by carbon fiber. We have illuminated control elements on the steering wheel for a 24-hour race. And with one of the best safety architecture in its segment, we have provided a special um, carbon safety cell together with a steel roll bar that is bolted structural to the aluminium uh, space frame. The GT4, like the series production car, features our 4-liter V8 by turbo engine. With the GT3, we go to the start line with our proven 6.3-liter V8 naturally aspirated engine with 550 horsepower. The two have everything that's needed to clock up racing success, and the GT3 proved that not only with the legendary quadruple victory at the 24-hour race on the Nürburgring 2016 we heard about before. So the GT was not only born on the racetrack, it is also born for the racetrack. And the road version, the GTR, underlined this with the record time for all series road sports cars at the Nürburgring Nordschleife, 
for sport auto super test with seven minutes and eleven seconds. So, how will things now carry on with our GT family? We have got already eight brothers and sisters, and there is one cousin ready to go. With the AMG GT concept, we demonstrated in Geneva where the, GD, uh, where the journey is leading us to the next GT family member and simultaneously to the next independent development from Afalterbach, which will be presented next year in 2018. But one thing I can already promise you today, this car will also make a lot of fun to drive. So we think you will enjoy it, so please stay tuned. Thank you very much.